All right, so for this demo, we're going to do a human battery. So I've got a voltmeter, a multimeter, right here. And so we can measure uh, direct current voltage with this, among other things. But right now, we only care about direct current voltage. So I've got uh, basically an anode and a cathode. I have a steel rod connected to the voltmeter, and I have a copper rod connected to the voltmeter. So, let's get these guys untangled. I'm going to turn on this voltmeter, turn it on to the 2 volt, actually we'll go ahead and go to the, yeah we'll go 2 volts. So this will be measuring volts. So right now, basically just bouncing around zero, and it should be zero. Just kind of bouncing around, having a little fluctuation. But when I connect the circuit, just bouncing around zero right now. But as soon as I grab the other rod, and I'm holding both rods, now we've got 0.1 volts. So 0.11 volts, 0.12 volts, still going up, and the electricity is coming from chemical reaction happening between my hand and one of the rods or possibly both of the rods, I can't really remember. But we've got 0.15 volts, and if I squeeze it hard, generally the harder you squeeze it, the better connection you get, the more the reaction happens. I think it might have something to do with surface area, something like that. But I've got it up to 0.18 volts, 0.19 volts, and when you have a bunch of people in a line, you can get up quite a ways, enough to power something. 0.22 volts. 0.23. Oh, and also this will... This will also work if I'm just holding both of them in one hand. And they're not touching each other. I'm just holding both of them in one hand. There you have it.